If you saw the thumbnail or even read the title, you're probably wondering what the hell am I talking about addicts are the lucky ones. Well, stick around and I'll explain why. What's up everybody, this is Chris from The Rewired Soul where we talk about the problem but focus on the solution. And today I bought the book Recovery by Russell Brand. I'll put a link to the book below. But anyways, I have this love-hate relationship with Russell Brand. Like when I first started seeing him in movies when he started gaining traction, I'm like, oh, it's this guy, I don't really like him. And I just had all these weird problems with him. But anyways, I've been really into him lately, like listening to his podcast, watching his videos on YouTube, and this dude just knows his stuff. So when this book came out, I was waiting for it to come out on audiobook, because as I've mentioned, I read my books by listening to them when I'm driving to work. And I just started this book, and all I could think when this dude is talking is just preach. Like he is dropping so much truth, I love it. I just started and I just cannot wait to finish this book. It's phenomenal so far. So even if you're watching this and you're not an addict in recovery, like, let me make it perfectly clear. This book is not specifically for addicts. Like, you need to check this book out. And plus, I've been thinking about starting some kind of mental health book club. So this would be a great start. So check out the link below, get this book, and we'll talk about it because I'll be doing more videos on it. Anyways. This video is about a quote that was towards the beginning of this book, and here's a little clip for you. We are all on the addiction scale. Those of us born with clear-cut and blatant substance addiction are in many ways the lucky ones. We alcoholics and junkies have minimized our mystery to tiny cycles of craving and fulfillment. Our pattern is easier to observe and therefore with commitment and help, easier to resolve. If your personal pattern happens to be the addiction equivalent of the long-form con trick as opposed to a short grift, it can take ages to know just what your problem is. So this is something that I realized in my early recovery, and it holds even more true the longer I stay clean and sober. Like, we addicts, we're the lucky ones. We're very lucky for a variety of reasons. And as you heard from that clip, all of us are struggling with something. The word disease, when you break it into two parts, dis-ease, right? People all over the world, whether they find drugs or alcohol, they're dealing with this dis-ease. Now, for some of us, one out of every 12 people, we struggle with drugs or alcohol. That's the way our disease manifests. And it's much easier to spot. You see the junkie, you see the alcoholic. That's what we found out. And because of that, I found a better way of living. I didn't pick up my first drink or drug until I was 18, but my life was absolutely miserable before then. And had I not become an addict, an alcoholic, I don't know if I would ever live the amazing life that I have today because I would have never found different programs or paths to mental stability and peace and serenity that I found just by getting clean. And this is a message that I try to share with anybody, anybody who's just getting clean, because I know for me, when I first got sober, like I was like, this is a curse, this is a burden. And the longer you stay clean, you start to realize that this is a blessing. See. I work at a treatment center with a lot of people who are trying to get clean. My facility that I personally have an office at has anywhere from 150 to 200 people at any given time. I work with a lot of people just trying to get sober. And I try to explain to them like, you are very lucky. You are fortunate. You get to learn about stuff and ways to improve yourself that most of the world will never even see throughout the rest of their lives, right? And this isn't just a sales pitch, like this is the truth. I break it down like this. 99% of my friends are normies. For those of you who don't know what a normie is, a normie is just someone who's not an addict or an alcoholic. I explain to people that most of my friends, most of the people I interact with are normies. Heck, even some of my coworkers, most of my coworkers are normies. And when another addict or alcoholic comes to me and they need advice or they need a suggestion, I have just a laundry list of things I can help them with. Even if you're watching this and you struggle with mental illness, like I have ways to help you, but there's a whole world of people out there who struggle with these issues and I can't give them the same suggestions. I cannot tell them to go to a meeting, call a sponsor, meditate, 
you know, get in touch with your spirituality, you know, all these different things. I can't tell them that. Like when my friends come to me and they're normies and they're like dealing with relationship issues or shopping issues or just certain situations that they bring on themselves, I'm very limited on the suggestions I can give them. I'm like, maybe you should see a therapist. I don't know. Like I'm very limited on that. So this is why being an addict is a blessing. But most of all, the reason why us addicts are the lucky ones is because discovering I was an addict and seeing the path that it was taking me on, it gave me a purpose in life. And I'm gonna do another video about these existential crises that people go through, like what's the meaning of life and stuff. Like I found that my purpose is simply to help other people. And that's the best purpose purpose anybody can have because I always have a purpose every single day when I wake up. So if you're out there and you're just now getting sober or you're scared to get sober, remember this is actually a blessing. You are one of the lucky ones. There are people who have this disease manifesting in an endless amount of ways and they're never going to address it. So the fact that yours manifested in a way that you could actually acknowledge means that you have a much better chance of being on the right path. So if you are interested in checking out this book, Recovery by Russell Brand, please click on the link below and get it from Amazon. It is an affiliate link, so it's no extra charge to you, but it helps support the channel, helps me make more beautiful beautiful videos like this. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you check the book out, leave your comments down below. I would love to hear what you think about this book or just on this topic in general. But anyways, if you haven't yet and you're new here right below this box, please hit that subscribe button. I'm always making mental health videos and addiction videos and I have a million more videos out there. So over there on the left, click or tap and check out some other videos on this channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.